Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen, YouTube, but this is Burning Metal. Tonight, we are going to dive into a six-leaf knife. This is the SL21, and we're going to take a little nip or two from the very old St. Nick ancient cask bourbon whiskey from Preservation Distillery. Here we go. Let's take a look at this lovely sleek design. So Six Leaf is the sister company of, I believe, Tucson. Tucson is a Chinese manufacturer using some pretty interesting designers that are doing some really fresh, uh, lovely things. And this happens to be a prime example of that. Uh, this lovely knife tonight is coming to us. Uh, with titanium handle scales, that lovely straight line razor design. Uh, yeah, definitely straight razor risk, yet uh, you could see hmm, sheep footish. Uh, definitely straight edge, great for slicing, cutting, opening packages. What a lovely knife to carry. That wonderful milling and the lines, the gold in black just work for me and i'm not usually a gold guy but mm, drop shut centered hidden lanyard hole thank you rattlesnake designs oh, what a tragedy that would be if that had a hole drilled in it for a lanyard oh, much better solution titanium milled pocket clip frame lock back flipper We'll see if we'll embarrass ourselves here. We'll, oh yeah, top roll that and uh, yeah, thumb roll it. What a great knife. Really stunning little everyday carry that really is elegant and sleek in its design. Uh, man, big fan of this. Don't know why I haven't seen more people review this SL21. So we have a blade length of 3.11 inches. Uh, handle is 4.2 inches. And then we have a weight of 3.79. So 106 grams. Uh, really perfect weight and balance. And of course this is in 154 cm stainless steel and you can see i've used this quite a bit <laughs> right up there at the dip you can see uh that's where i cut a lot of boxes packages things this is a really thin razor sharp angle and a perfect thickness i guess i should suppose uh, should get deeper into this and let you know all of that information but all i know is it fits and feels ooh, so right so sl21 goddamn what a great knife and what a fun way to get it you know it's kind of old school going back and uh <laughs> having to play the game with an eBay auction and wait to that last minute to up your price and beat the other guy and that's kind of how you'll win these at a decent price so hey have a little bit of fun with it it was great because the Chinese New Year and they shut down and I couldn't order any more of these things for a minute so eh, I may have one or two up and coming so stay tuned <laughs> here is the very old St. Nick ancient cask. This is from Preservation Distillery. This is a non-age statement. I believe this may be blended with some younger whiskeys, but on the nose, there is a very nice old dusty deep bourbon note to it. Just leathered old oak candy. Just a sweetness, mm, like if you had a leather oak lozenge, and I mean that in a good way. It's kind of funky, but good. If you know some good old bourbon, you'll understand. Hmm. Take a little sip, give you my impressions of it, and uh, we'll do a little comparison with this six-leaf. Uh, 
What a great knife, SL21. Very nice, thick, viscous mouthfeel. 97.1 proof. Good, long, punchy finish on this. Really, like I said, sweet. It's it's like a, a old, dusty oat candy that was stored in a leather bag. And that may sound funky to some people, but I think that's the accurate description. And mm, I enjoy it. Uh, definitely. So, mm, in comparison, we have this lovely little sleek razor style, straight edge, kind of somewhat not quite as sheep footish, but uh, maybe cleaver like, uh, definitely straight razor like. We have the QSP Penguin in D2, denim micarta, liner lock, uh, on those smooth mm, copper washers. Nice jimping, great little knife, just just the perfect amount of edge and grip and straight edge for just everyday basic utilitarian cuts. We'll wipe her off a little bit there, get some of the smooge off there, because you know I actually use these things. <laughs> and a little bit still left on this side, so hey. But in comparison, um, maybe a little bit more substantial blade on the uh, SL21 in comparison. Uh, of course, everybody knows, everybody loves, everybody seeing the old Kershaw link, and those match up pretty well. Of course, you got a little bit of curvature, a little bit to the belly of this, and a straight, super pointy Warren Cliff style. Uh, damn. Still love that. Um, very practical, useful, and uh, nasty <laughs> design, if you really think about it. But uh, hey, the SL21 is a great gentleman's carry. Um, definitely. Uh, you look sleek, you look classy, and this is coming to you at a good price if you can uh, nab one of these at auction. So with that said, have a knife day.